Basically, every project that I've done started kind of playing around. You never know where you're going to get ideas from. And I think you sort of, there's a lot of experimenting, and I think it's just the general curiosity to fulfill, and I think that's what play is, is just, you know, like fulfilling that kind of curiosity, going and just seeing what happens when you do this or do that. And, and it's not only like just fun to see what happens in interactions between objects, but you learn something and it could lead to another thing or do something else. I mean, it's hard to try to keep things fresh because it's easy to get, you know, in a regimented mode and this works, okay, let's just do that. If you never play, you're, you know, it be pretty straightforward. But I think once you sort of goof off a little bit, you'll see that there's, the universe is bigger, yeah. you know? And like, I'm starting to play with these bubble wrap. And what, I, like, what attracts me to this is kind of the dot pattern in the bubble wrap. And then this is actually just the very the test with um, like hair gel on bubble wrap, and so this is just to see like I bought this is called this stuff called Manic Panic, and it's like a magenta hair dye and cyan. So then I basically colored these dots of the um, bubble wrap and then just layered them on top. So then hopefully later on down the line I can make silk screens of this. I mean I, I could also hand paint these dots to try to create a, I guess like a, you know, the recreate the dot halftone pattern. Uh, this is a color chart that I made uh, for, to study for, for making uh, taste tests in color. And this is a chart that I made so I can see the way the color comes out, you know, and also reacts over time and, and reacts to the paper and certain things so I can, I can have some sort of idea what the, material looks like. Like for instance, this is Nestle Quick next to Market Pantry Chocolate Syrup. Here's Tang, which is interesting because you think Tang is a yellow bright thing, but eventually it turns like a, a muddy, like brownish, orangish color. Here's Pediatric Electrolyte Grape Flavor, which that actually, I never made a print with that, but that looks pretty good. Some cough syrups. And here's a little section of a bunch of bubble gums that I've tested out. Um, you know, five vortex, stride spark, 